All right, this is another members exclusive. Now, the other day, when I was with Steve Balpony, I uh, trained him for his fight at Worlds Collide. We, we did something which was basically a double over. Now, what I was doing there was I was coming here and I was securing both arms. And as I did it, I was taking my chin and driving it in and kind of using that Jean Bell grip, three finger grip, and then at the same time, I was pushing my body down and I was coming over securing this arm. Something else you can do from this position is a front face lock or a grommet, which is basically you take your fist, you jam it right across his face, and then you grab. You grab right on your own forearm, keeping him tight in, and then what you do is you go up and out. Oh. And that will crank the hell out of your yeah, neck. He's gonna tap. Um, that's actually an old school uh, Lancashire uh, catch a sketch can uh, pro wrestling movie. It's called a grabbit. Some people call it a front face slap. So I'll just do the front face slap part again, real, real. So actually, we'll do it from the beginning. Double overhook, press in, down, secure this arm, cross the face. Now, what I'm doing is I'm taking my fist and I'm driving it. At the same time, I'm taking that same old sharp bone. And I'm taking it across, and I'm grabbing his tricep. I want you to turn him that way so they can see the, the grab. This way, like, right here. Uh, I'm holding his tricep, and I'm coming in, pow, across the face. And I'm grabbing my own forearm, and I'm going up and away. And basically, don't ever throw somebody in that move. Because you will break their neck unless you're in a self-defense situation. If you got somebody there, you roll and throw them, their neck's going to snap because it's in a really odd spot. That's a front face side with a grabbit and a setup with a double overhook. Thank you. That's a lethal, lethal move. Yeah, it's, a, it's simple, but it hurts like hell. Yeah, a lot of guys in the, in the Army and Marines and Navy, the martial arts and suckers that teach The McMap. You did the McMap kind of when you were in the, you did the McMap when you were in the military? Yeah, but depending on what uh, what level you're on, like the level, it's kind of like, you know, like civilian karate. They go yeah. on belts, and you have to be a certain rank to do that because they want you to train the younger. Movements. Yeah. Like I know the, the, the black belts, they know all kinds of stuff. They yeah. do boxing drills and yeah. a lot, most of it's wrestling. Because we did a McMap training at our summer camp, at the American Combat Summer Camp. We had a McMap guy come down, and uh, they got some good, they got some good stuff. It, it, they, they go, man. They train right yeah. out there on the ground. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's good training. Yeah, well, thank you, you guys. You're in real good shape. 